What's going on guys, Coach Manley here, Team Soul Patrol. No training footage for you today, but what I do have is a question I got from the mailbag that I think a lot of you might want to hear. This one comes from on Chris Wood, it says, Yo Manler, how do I get over my height complex? I feel inferior and pathetic due to being only 5 foot 6 inches tall. Chris, I'm glad you reached out to me and I am more than happy to share my pearls of wisdom with you because I do have a strong opinion on this issue and think you can learn a lot from what I do have to say. So hold tight because I'm about to take you to school, son. Now, Chris and whoever else out there might be having the same issues with these insecurities, I'm going to give you the same advice I would give anybody, all right? If you watched the last video I put out about how indecision can lead to inaction, and inaction is the key to all failure, in my eyes, it's, it's much the same way with insecurities. Insecurities will keep you from having the confidence to go out and do the things necessary to kick the shit out of life. So, first things first, understand that one, this is only an insecurity, and two, everyone has insecurities, it's how you deal with them and move forward that will dictate the success you will have in getting over this shit and kicking ass in life. Look man, I'm just like you, I'm not perfect. I've got some insecurities, I've got some physical flaws, all right, but you know what? Fuck it, I don't care. I got a left ear that sticks out further than my right. I got a fat ass nose. I got a weird shaped head. I move my hands around on video all spastically like a retarded meathead version of Ricky Bobby. But you know what? I fucking own it. I don't let shit get to me. And that's what you should do. It's kind of like, what is that? That movie Boiler Room. Act as if. Act as if instead of you being five foot six, you're seven foot tall with a big swinging dick. Act as if you walk around like you own the fucking place. That confidence is what will eventually get you, even if you're faking it, the whole fake until you make it mindset, even if you're doing that, eventually you will start to believe that shit and take more of the risks that get you more of the finer fruits in life. The second thing I'd tell you is this. Life is absolutely chock full of stressors, positive and negative. One of the things that I'll tell you that my father has always told me is that you need to stop stressing about the shit that you cannot control and instead focus and funnel all of your time, energy, and efforts into the things that you can control. I got news for you, man. You can, you can pray the, for, for height. You can do anything and everything in your powers that you think will lead to you getting taller, but that shit ain't going to work. You can thank your parents for your height, all right? can't control it. Hate to tell you that, but it's the truth. Instead of focusing on things like that, or seeing it as a limitation to whatever advancement you're, you're looking for in life, focus on the things that you can control, and focus on the positives of being your size. Uh, I'm assuming you're watching my channel because you give a shit about how you look and how you perform. In regards to that, being short is actually a benefit, all right? Um, in regards to strength, your, your, your height is probably going to mean, in all likelihood, that you have shorter levers, which will lead to more efficient lifts. So think of the positive that, uh, that is, is brought about by your height. Don't see it as a limitation. See it as a, as a means for you being more efficient for your ultimate goals. Whatever you do, don't focus on the negatives of it and quit focusing on shit that you can't really control. Wipe out those negative stressors and start worrying about the shit that you can work with. And the last thing I'll say is this, man. If your height is the biggest stress in your life, then I'm going to have to fuck you up with some truth. I don't want to pick on you or seem like I'm picking on you, but you need to hear this, man. It's time you look in the mirror and man the fuck up and realize that if this is the biggest stress you have in life, then it's time to open your eyes. There are millions and millions and millions of people throughout the world that can't find a bite to eat, that don't have a mattress to sleep on, that have it far, far fucking worse than you or I do, all right? I'm just as guilty uh, at times of wanting more and not appreciating what I've got, 
but at the same time, you have to realize that you have so, so much more in life that you need to be appreciative of than so many others would just beg and could only dream about. So the way I see it, if you're able to watch this video right now, then you need to realize that you are too damn blessed to be so damn stressed. So in conclusion, man, just simply take home these quick tips. Fake it till you make it, you know, act as if you're that seven foot tall, 12 inch dick hanging, ass kicking machine that owns the world, all right? That will give you the confidence you need to kick ass in life. And um, other than that, simply put, stop stressing about shit you can't control and focus your time and energy on the things you can. And most importantly, learn to appreciate what you got because that is a gift in and of itself. And there are many others that would do anything to be able to walk in your shoes. Hey guys, sorry if it seems like I got preachy there or was pontificating about this subject, but nevertheless, I thought you might want to hear my opinion on it. If you do have any other questions for me about training, uh, diet, or anything in general about life in regards to things inside or outside the gym, please leave that question in the comment section below. Like the video, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on anything in the future. And if you're trying to build more muscle that allows you to look good while kicking ass, then do yourself a favor right now and click right here to get a free copy of the Muscle Building Blueprint completely free of charge. Like I said, it's completely free, so just click right there and I'll take you to the next page, which breaks it all down for you. Appreciate your time, guys. Have a good one. Mandler.